morning YouTube JJ Texas crappy assassins I am out here Sunday March 7th I'm supposed to have my tournament this morning but only a few boats showed up so I just called it so um, I'm gonna catch me a mess of fish hopefully and uh, Right now I got my 14 foot salters. I got a black and chartreuse hair tie. I'm running uh, two bobber stops, a bead, two quarter ounce sinkers, another bead, and another bobber stop on top. And uh, we're gonna see what we can do. So y'all stay tuned. So, with that, they don't want this. Yeah. Guided trip yesterday, and the fish. Didn't want jigs, they wanted minnows. So, I just so happened to have some minnows because I was gonna fish a tournament. So, we are going to see if that's still the case. fishing with me all but spawned out and I'm gonna keep some today whoa 
Alright. A couple more there. Let's see if I can't get another one off of that tree. They are not hitting it hard, I'll tell you that. This is just my setup there. Quarter ounce, a couple beads, bobber stop, gold Aberlane, and a minnow. Shed, it's no wonder they're not that hungry. They've been feeding good. There's a nice one on top of that tree. Beats dropping down to them. All you minnow haters out there I get it but if that's what they want that's what you got to feed them No monster. What? Came out and smashed it. He didn't want them crappie to get it. <laughs> finicky but we can get a few of them to still eat I'm hoping you guys are seeing the live scope I'm not sure I'm keep trying to do a little different stuff for y'all no because I'm just about where I need to be you saw it here he comes got him Got some fungi on him. On a deal. Crazy. It's an 
eating size fish. As you can see all that on his gill. I'm just gonna say, oop, not today. Thanks for eating my minnow. Right there. Let's see if I can convince him this time. Oh, nice fish too. Try that smaller one the one. Nope. I'm gonna put a minnow on this jig. See if he'll eat that. I'm telling you, they ain't really been wanting the jigs. We'll tip it and see. He's just kind of sitting there. See if he'll eat that. Top of him, he won't touch it. Big old slab. Drum. Roman drum. You can get off any minute. Look at it, he's playing dead. You can come off. Go ahead, get out of there. Alright, I'm about to flip this drum into the boat. With this 14 footer. That says a little something about these Salter's rods, y'all. They are good rods. That's why I use them. And that fish was just a roaming out there in open water. It looked like a big old crappie. Jig. 
jack plum loaded y'all good look like a bunch of white crappie too He just barely grabbed it. Here we go. <laughs> well, it wasn't all that big, and it got off, but there was one on that blue and silver, which is good. All right, y'all, I'm gonna change modes a little bit. Show you what I just, I came to some, came over to some bluegill beds. To see if there was any in there. It's the second one I caught, so I'm gonna keep you guys going here. And see if I can't get a few more. Just using the red worm and slip cork. Well, y'all, wasn't a lot of action, but should be enough to bring a video to y'all. So hit that like, subscribe button, and we'll see you on the next one.